Hey guys, yes, we're live at Pass and Provisions on Taft here in Houston. And joining me are the owners and chefs, Seth Siegel Gardner and Terrence Gallivan. They are partners here in the restaurant. They are competing on Sunday, November 3rd, at an event called the Fight Against Cancer, the Food Fight Against Cancer. And they're going to show us how to make their competition dish. Show us how to get started, guys. First, we're going to start with a truffle and mushroom puree. Mm -hmm. Truffle puree. Truffle puree. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're trying to use all the, as many ingredients that uh, help to combat cancer as possible. So uh, in this dish, it's a dish, a variation of dish we've done before. We've kind of added a, a number of ingredients that uh, are known to fight cancer. Uh, so this crumble that we've made here is started with almonds or almond meal, mm -hmm. uh, which is a legitimate cancer fighting ingredient. And then we also have some uh, black sesame also, again. Black sesame seeds. Yeah, yeah. so, so they just, both of which has just been toasted. Mm -hmm. uh, the buckwheat has actually been popped, like much like you would do. Like, and how do you work. toast the seeds, Chef? Just, just in a pan, just very lightly in a pan. Like uh, no like, oil or anything, no, dry, no, dry, right? Exactly, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, so then we're just gonna, to build the dish, we start kind of just spooning this crumble, as mm -hmm. we like to call it on top. Uh, the buckwheat and the um, sesame will add a nice kind of crunch to it. That looks nice. Seth? So here we have some pickled haunch medgy mushrooms. So basically Look at how cute those mushrooms are. And we learned in the 8 o'clock segment, Seth, that all variants of mushrooms are very, very good to fight cancer. And basically we're using three different types of mushrooms in here. So we have some dried shiitakes, pickled haunch medgies, and then we're also shaving some raw mushrooms on top. Wow, so we great. don't really cook the mushrooms too much. Yeah, great use of mushrooms. All right. Uh, and then, so this is kind of the, we are big fans of eggs here at the restaurant. So mm -hmm. if you come and join us, we always have tons of different types of egg dishes on the menu at some point. Yeah. Uh, this this particular one is just a chicken egg we've, put, we've been poaching uh, very lightly in a kayeshi, which is basically uh, an enriched uh, a, a dashi or something. We use lots well, of truffles. It, for us at home, it looks like a broth. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So it's a really kind of rich, fairly salty. Uh, we've added black garlic, which is oh. essentially fermented garlic. Yes. Uh, again, uh, garlic being another uh, cancer fighting ingredient. And that will also infuse some extra flavor into exactly, the egg. Yeah, so That's something rich. we can do at home, everyone, is uh, to poach your egg or cook your egg, use a broth rather than plain water. Yeah, you just, you know, once you, we've soft boiled them, we kind of just lightly uh, warm them back up in, a, in, a, in a, as much flavor as possible. And I so use a little bit of kombu in the broth as well. It's also very good. Yeah. Or cancer fighting and ingredient. everyone the chefs are giving us the recipe with all of these ingredients it will be available for Monday. you Monday. it will be available Monday <laughs> after the competition. oh that's right after the competition that's right <laughs> not giving away any secrets right at houstontexasfood.com <laughs> and this is the finished dish right yeah exactly so we just finished it with some uh, like Seth said some uh, raw shaved mushrooms these happen to be matsutakis but we just use whatever exactly we have excellent this great use of mushrooms and I, I love this tip about poaching the egg in a broth Love that. All right, you guys are competing on Sunday, November 3rd, in the fight against cancer. It's yep. going to be held at the Sparrow Bar and Cook Shop, and you hope to win that trophy, right? Yes, the Garden Garrett is coming home. And then, er everyone, this is what it looks like when it's done. You can, uh, the nice uh, yolk is nice and soft. And we want to make sure that the artist of the trophy, his name is John Clark, a local artist, actually created and donated that trophy. The website to buy tickets, everyone, is thefoodfightagainstcancer.com.